not just by being the party out of power in Washington, not just by being the non-Obama or the non-Pelosi, although that'll help. <laughs> we'll win because our ideas will carry the day. Because we have candidates who will stand up for our founding principles, who will stand up and guide our nation through these difficult times and make decisions that are the right decisions, whether they're popular or not, who will put national security first, who recognize that for us to be strong abroad, we have to be strong at home, who will be unabashedly pro-entrepreneurial, pro-small business, pro-capitalist, unlike the message that is coming from too many of our leaders today that view profit as evil and something to be torn down. We will win because we have superior ideas, more articulate candidates willing to make those difficult decisions, not just to get through the next election, not just to get a band-aid on the budget, but to make the right decisions for our children and our grandchildren. And all of you are at the tip of the spear in that movement. You were right months before the rest of America figured it out. You were trying to tell people two years ago where that type of leadership would get our country. You knew before the 08 election what a President Obama might mean for this country and what socialized medicine would do to your relationship between a doctor and the patient. You knew that the big government ideas were wrong for our country and they're wrong for Florida. And today the rest of the country is coming around to your way of thinking. 